Hi, you guys. Welcome back. Okay, so my BoxyCharm base box finally showed up. Okay, so <laughs> let's go ahead and open this puppy up and see what we got. Oh, I got a card in this one. Y'all know in my premium, I didn't get no card, okay? But this one has a card. So it says BoxyCharm Mother Nature really pretty i'm assuming that was because mother's day was this month very pretty card and i have variation 15 one five okay so let's just see what we got okay so let me take out this first item here very big item this is from tart Ooh, okay very very cute this is micellar magic makeup remover and cleanser this is what she looks like in the package. So let me open her up. Oh, and this is a pretty decent sized bottle. Very, very nice size. Cute packaging. It has the little label that with the see-through. What is that? Leaves, flowers, plants, something in the back, but it's very cute. Okay, so this is Tarte Micellar Magic Makeup Remover and Cleanser. The ultimate lazy girl hack, this micellar water is a gentle, no rinse facial cleanser that removes waterproof and long wear makeup, excess oil and impurities without stripping your skin's natural moisture. Okay, very nice. Doesn't strip your skin. Retails for $18, okay? So I'm actually happy about this. <laughs> I like different type of makeup removers, micellars, cleansers, melt-offs, all that stuff. So I'm happy with that. Next big thing I have in here is from Elemis. This is Dynamic Resurfacing Facial Pads. So this is what the container looks like. And I also like stuff like this, even though, <laughs> I don't know, is this skincare? Yeah, I think this is skincare. Yeah, this ain't makeup. This is skincare. It's makeup remover. So it's for the care of your skin. Another skincare item. But I do like resurfacing products things that bring my skin you know remove the old and dead and bring it back to life so i do like products like this i've never tried any resurfacing facial pads so let me see what it says powered by elemis patented tri enzyme technology combined with a mild lactic acid and probiotic ferment complex to gently yet effectively smooth the skin, revealing a visibly luminous complexion. Retails for 59 Zolas, okay? There's 60 pads in here. Okay, so that's not bad. So it's basically like a dollar a pad retails for. So I'm very curious about these using them um, after I cleanse my skin. Okay, next here I have a lip product. This is from Appeal. I've never heard of Appeal. This is what it looks like. That's a pretty color though. So it says here, Appeal Cosmetics Ultra Cream Liquid Lipstick. Yeah, I do like that color. That's like a really pretty, like rosy nude shade. A luxurious cream lipstick that slides on with ease and stays comfortable all day. All day, okay. This lipstick has a satin finish and covers with one application, rich in color and is a decadent addition to everyone's makeup collection. Retails for $21. Okay. Um, it's a really pretty color just by the looks of it. I'm not going to open it now because I do have other lipsticks in this shade, but I will be trying this soon because it's very, very pretty. Next, I have here something from Pretty Vulgar. Okay, I have really been loving the Pretty Vulgar products that I've been getting in my BoxyCharm. Whenever I do get products by Pretty Vulgar, I kind of get excited because all the products that I've received from them, I like. So I'm never mad to see Pretty Vulgar. Now, this is Uncaged Eyeshadow Primer. It's a blendable, lightweight, skin-smoothing formula that will enhance your eyeshadows by making them vibrant and long-wearing. Infused with mineral-rich clay to absorb excess oil, it will deliver a crease-proof, fade-proof, translucent finish that is suitable for all skin tones. Retails for $22. Okay. Okay. So, let me see if this has a seal. No. It's like a tube like this. Okay, and so that's what it looks like. Doesn't smell like anything. Okay, so it is very creamy. 
and it does kind of just you know there's a little bit that you can see on there you know but yeah it does kind of like fade into the skin a little bit so yeah and it looks like a decent eyeshadow base and it feels like it dries down yeah so if you like an eyeshadow base that's just a base and not like a white or bright base then it looks like this is going to be nice feels good too okay and lastly i do have an eyeshadow palette in here it looks like it's from studio makeup ease to wear eyeshadow palette plain black packaging nothing fancy schmancy this is what the back looks like hmm okay let's open this puppy up Yo, <laughs> what is this? <laughs> what is, why, why, Lord, why? Mm, mm, mm. Well, I don't have much to say about this. This reminds me of that Urban Decay palette that I just bought. Hold on. Yeah, this thing on Naked Reloaded. I, I told you guys, I don't know why I bought this thing. <laughs> I don't know why. It's, I don't know, honey. But it reminds me of this palette. So let me hold these two palettes up together. Oh, Lord have mercy. Now I got two palettes I don't want. <laughs> now I got two palettes I don't want. Okay, so yeah, I definitely, honey, this is like the Naked Reloaded had a baby okay mm, mm, mm. let me let you guys know what it says about this palette <laughs> mm. studio makeup ease to wear eyeshadow palette displays a versatile color scheme complementing all skin tones i don't think so <laughs> for the creation of countless natural and glam looks this all day to all night creamy smooth eyeshadow texture glides on and blends with ease Providing true color coverage in a single stroke. Retails for $35. Yeah, uh-uh. Nope, nope, nope. Nope. <laughs> oh my goodness. Okay, so is that everything? Yeah, that's everything. Okay, you guys. So that's everything that I got in my BoxyCharm box. This is just my base box. You guys saw what I got in my premium. Um... I'm happy about this. I mean, it's cleansing water. It's cool. These resurfacing pads, I'm happy about these. I do like these type of products, so I am going to use them. This lipstick is cute. The color is real cute. And the eyeshadow primer from Pretty Vulgar, I'm actually happy about this because I like trying out different eyeshadow primers, you know, to see what works best. And I like Pretty Vulgar. So, yeah, I would say I'm happy about everything except for this. And, you know, the palette is something that we really look forward to. And I know I put in my profile, don't send me nothing like this. <laughs> you know, send me the boldest, brightest palettes that you have or send me something else. But anyway. I got a baby naked reloaded, okay? So that's it, you guys. Hopefully you enjoy watching me quickly go through my boxy base box to see what I got. Version 15. So I guess now I'm just waiting to see what I get in my boxy lux to see if I will continue to be a boxy charm subscriber, okay? So that's it, you guys. Thanks so much for hanging out, and I will see you on my next video. Toodles!